People everywhere are making choices more connected with their values. We are simplifying our lives, buying less, and living more because we know that the earth supplies enough for everyone's need, but not everyone's greed. We recycle because we know the earth's resources are limited and that we must share those resources with those yet to come. We buy fair labor and fair trade goods in order to, well, be fair. We buy organic to keep chemicals off the land and out of our water, to protect wildlife, to keep farm workers and their children safe, and to keep our bodies healthy. We conserve water, save energy, and plug into the power of Mother Nature because we realize that when we make connected choices, we not only build better lives for ourselves, we build a better world for everyone. Still, there is one connected choice that often gets overlooked. It's one of the most far-reaching personal, practical, and ethical choices you can make. With this choice, we can help feed ourselves and every hungry person on the planet. End deforestation. Replenish the deep woods of the north and save our disappearing rainforests. Revitalize our rural landscapes and save family farms. Stop the number one polluter of water and the number one waster of water. Return our oceans to thriving underwater worlds teeming with life and wonder. Make cancer and heart disease a rarity instead of a common occurrence. And return wild lands to their rightful owners. This powerful choice can be done by everyone, every day, by you, right now, with this. We are all connected. The choices we make affect not only our lives, but the lives of other people. If we use more than our share, we are taking from other people and from those yet to come. In this day and age, in a world of plenty, it is difficult to understand how, all over the world, nearly a billion people are going hungry, and 40,000 will starve to death every single day. This doesn't happen because there isn't enough for everyone. This happens because, while people are starving, we are wasting enormous amounts of grain to feed cows, pigs, chickens, and other animals so that we may satisfy our desire for meat, milk, and eggs. The Earth can provide only so much food. While the human population is growing and growing, the tiny amount of land on which we can grow food is not. Because raising animals for food takes so much land, water, and other resources, the Earth would be able to sustain only about 2 billion people on a meat and dairy based diet. With a world population of nearly 7 billion people, it's easy to see that we need to find a better way. Vegan choices support a world where all may be fed. Vegan choices require only a fraction of the land and far fewer resources than what is needed to produce animal products. The equation is simple. The fewer animal products we consume, the more people we can feed. If we ignore this simple fact, more and more people will be going hungry as the world population continues to grow. Vegan choices also promote your own health and the health of others. The number one killers in the United States, heart disease and cancer, are conclusively linked to consuming animal products. Vegan choices work to make these diseases a rarity and refuse to contribute to their escalating spread around the world as animal-based diets are pushed on other countries and upon the poor. Millions of people, instead of supporting the export of disease and hunger, are taking personal responsibility. They are being the change they want to see in the world. Their vegan choices are prolonging and bettering their own lives, easing the burden on the planet, and making a life-sustaining commitment to future generations. Vegan choices conserve land, water, and energy. In fact, 
Raising animals for food consumes so many resources that making vegan choices is one of the most powerful things you can do as an individual to help save the planet. One of the top contributors to global climate change is raising animals for food. That's right. While we're being encouraged to change our light bulbs and drive hybrid automobiles, the United Nations found that raising animals for human consumption contributes to global warming more than all the planes, cars, and trucks on the planet combined. 40% more. To feed and water farmed animals takes enormous amounts of water. To produce just one pound of meat requires on average 2,500 gallons of water. A gallon of cow's milk 750 gallons of water. By simply making vegan choices, you can save over